All right, what's up, my friends? It's time for version 3.0 of Duncan Dinos. What is Duncan Dinos? This is a deck I built earlier this week. Um, we played uh, a few leagues with it so far. It's built based around Wayward Sword Tooth and Experimental Frenzy. So basically, the concept is you give a dinosaur coffee, what happens? Frenzy is the hot new card from Guilds of Ravnica, uh, Future Sight esque card. And. This card is busted by itself. It's a really, really great card. Um, the problem is you're playing it and you hit two lands in a row. And you kind of fiddle around and don't do much, right? So that breaks the chain. So we're playing Wayward Swordtooth for the clear stop of our deck. It plays extra lands. And the more mana you have, the more cards you can play. And the more cards you can play, the more cards you draw a Frenzy. And you just go bananas. Uh, this deck has been really, really cool. Um, we've played two leagues so far. I think we went, we went 4 1 and 2 3. Um, our last league, we just played it and we had some pretty awkward matchups, but the engine is really, really good. Previous versions look something like this, where we were more focused on just uh, re removal spells, Dryad, Green Seeker, uh, Lana or Elf. There's more, more reasonable cards. The only dinosaurs in the deck were 4 Sword Tooth, but I wanted to try uh, a version of a deck that was playing more dinosaurs for a few reasons. One, we're already playing Sword Tooth, right? It's one of the most important cards in the deck, and. Commune with the Dinosaurs is a really good way to go find it. Also, we get to play Thunderherd Migration, which is essentially a Rampant Growth, if you have enough Dinosaurs in your deck. And Rampant Growth is very good in this deck, because you want to get more lands in play. So, in order to play these cards, though, we got to play at least maybe 12 Dinosaurs, maybe 13 Dinosaurs. So we're turning to um, a few cards we had in the sideboard already. Uh, Death Court Scavenger. I think this card might be like the underrated MVP of Standard right now. It's just good against everything. It just gains life against the aggro decks. Against the graveyard decks, it, it exiles stuff. Against the spell decks, it exiles their spells in the graveyard. Seems really, really good. It's possible we actually want more. But um, playing two main, two board. We have two Brontodons. Um, it's a good blocker, and it also can kill random enchantments and artifacts. It's possible we want four Death Gorge main, only two Brontodon on the board. Um, but we're going to try to mix right now and see how that goes. Um, we're also playing two copies of Ter Territorial Allosaurus. We're playing this over the 4-5 uh, Rip Draw Raptor. Because we're going to have a lot of mana, and being able to kick this is very reasonable. So it's a dinosaur, it's also a removal spell, which is kind of nice. It's possible Raptor's better, we're trying this one. But the big reason is Rage Store Alpha. Um, this card is very very good in, on rate alone. In that, like, it just, you know, 7 power for 5 mana, etc, etc. But the good thing is, by giving all your dinosaurs haste, now when you cast them off Frenzy, they can attack immediately. So you can kind of, like, chain them all together. So... A little more of a, a mid-rangey dinosaur deck with the frenzy thing. We're a little less focused on bane fire and fight with fire, um, but those are still an element. Actually, you know what? I think I'm going to change this deck a little, real fast. I'm going to add a third scavenger to the main and put a bane fire on the board. I, I think scavenger is actually really, really good. Um, so let's try this. So this is what we're going to play. Um, let's see one second to do that. Uh, sideboard's mostly the same as the previous version of the deck. Um, Spy glasses. We added two Carnage Tyrants to fit the Dinosaur theme, but for the most part, all the same stuff. Uh, Cannonade. Our Lava Coils are on the board now, so we're probably a little soft to Phoenix. Um, but we'll see. Spyglass. Canopy was also really good against... Actually, you know what? I'm going to add a Canopy, too. Look at this on-the-spot deck building. You know, we're just doing it. We're doing it live, as we always do. All right, so that's the deck. I think it's actually pretty sweet. Let's go the more dinosaur-heavy version of Duncan Dinos. Duncan Dino's Dino Mode. It's like Beast Mode, but with dinosaurs instead. Get it? Get it? Beast Mode? It's football. It's Sunday. Anyone? And you get it. All right. Let's go. What do you guys think? This version look better or worse? I think this version is probably worse, but we're going to try it out. I just think the card Death Gorge Scavenger is also great. So... Let's go, Duncan Dinos version three. All right, Thunderherd, Scavenger. This is good. I can keep this. Armasaur is just not good enough, I don't think. The problem is that, um, there's a lot of three mana dinosaurs, not a lot of cheap dinosaurs, and I think Scavenger is just better than everything. So, all right, Sacred Foundry tapped. Okay, this is fine. 
We're going to reveal, I guess, the scavengers are playing it next turn. Get a mountain. Next turn, we're probably going to commune for a land and cast Death Court Scavenger. We'll see what they do, though. We'll see if they're an aggro deck or a control deck. They're a control deck. Okay. I would say that this strategy probably seems worse against control than our previous strategy, uh, which is more focused on just casting Banefire. Um, all right, so there's some dinosaurs. We want the forest, though. Might have, they might have, it could have Essence Cat. There's a lot of cards they can have here that kind of just stink. Um, yeah, they were going to be significantly worse against control. I think that's a little too cute. Shadow Rorks. Yeah, it's more threat dense, but it's much weaker to, um... So we're not going to exile anything, right? Just leave those in the graveyard for now. Um, it's more threat dense, it's weaker to removal. You know, cards like Wrath of God, and Ritual of Soot, and Lightning Strike, and stuff that weren't that good against our last deck are much better here. I guess we have less removal in our deck, but land? Land. All right. I mean, this is probably getting countered, but dinosaurs don't exactly uh, have subtlety on their side. So, yeah, obviously. So, eh, not looking great. Search for Escanta. Okay. Yeah. Thunderherd Migration. All right. This is... We're playing Carney T in the board. So yeah, this is going to be a bloodbath, I think. Game 1 against Control Deck seems much worse. Old List had four treasure maps, had Karns, it binned and Ionize. Their hand must be so good. Alright, well, I mean, they only have three actual counter spells in their deck now. And we have Fight with Fire, so theoretically, if we just play our ninth land and Fight with Fire them twice, they could actually win the game. But, oh yeah, now five, six, seven, eight. All right, I mean, last league we went two, three, but we lost to a lot of kind of bad matchups. We lost to two Adanto Vanguard decks. That's a card we just can't kill. And we lost to a blue-red All Spells Arclight Phoenix deck, which seems tough for us because we just don't have any way to deal with their stuff. And they were, they were still close matches, um, so... I don't think you can play Commune and land or else. Oh my god. I mean, we might win this game based on this. If we just draw a land and go fight, 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 and kill them. They have to have three hard, or I guess two hard counter spells. Alright, so they're going to have to put their search here. They could have Syncopate actually too, I guess. I don't know how many, how many Syncopate this deck plays. Alright, well, here we go. Okay. Justice Strike is so good. This card's great. It's really, really good. Ionize, Ionize, Ionize. Yes! That is so good for us. One of the important things to recognize when you're playing against a control deck is their deck list matters. Because they're gonna be you're gonna play a really long game. And figuring out how many cards they actually have left is very important. So they only have two Iron Eyes left. Might have two Essence Cat. I mean, two uh, Syncopates. But I think if we draw a land, we go back to back to back here, we might just win the game. That doesn't hurt either. This is a Banefire for five, six, seven. Yeah, it's not really. I think we're going to wait on that. They obviously can't counter that one, so. Just gotta draw a card here. Just draw a land. Are they gonna oh that they, they, they the explosion card or whatever. Ugh, that's gross. Sphinx's revelation, basically. I don't think we strike. we do strike. Alright, they got a full grip. We've got a treasure map.
They can only see our hand right now, you know? This deck seems good. This card seems pretty good. Ral is it Viceroy has been revealed. Alright. This game is very weird. We look insanely behind, but I think we have like a pretty reasonable chance to win this game. Which is obviously weird given how how it looks. They just have seven cards, Escanta, ten lands, a planeswalker. But our hand's kinda stacked. It is funny when I'm alright, we're gonna top top the land. Alright. It's time to party. Fight with fire. Tenya. I can do this all day. And I will. Happily. Syncopate for one. Alright. So now they have two Ion Eyes and maybe a Syncopate left. Alright, yes. Been a land. Play to ferry or something, whatever. Just doesn't really matter. Counterspells or no counterspells? Can't scribe for a land here. Just can't risk it. If we draw a land, it's great though, because I would love to keep the map going. Oh, that's true. They can. No, it's, it's, it's mana cost four or less. I think if it's on a stack, the kicker makes it uh, cost not four mana. Upstairs. Hopefully their hand just all Wrath of Gods and Settler Wreckages. I mean, if this resolves, they have one turn to kill us, we bane fire them. So... <sighs> all right. Get ionized. Kicker, kicker does not change it? Okay. That's good to know. Well, next turn they ultimate row and probably kill us. So, lightning strike. I guess we gotta go row one, them nine now. So we don't, we, don't, we don't die the ultimate next turn. Alright. We did two, I guess. Buy a little more time. I don't know what buying more time actually does, though. As long as they're in Banefire range, it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah, let's do this. Eight... So they go to seven, and we have Banefire for enough. Sure. Fight with fire. All right, that's the that's the fourth Ionize. Well, now we just can't win. Yeah, we're just dead. All right. I mean, despite this being a bad matchup and so on, and everything going wrong this game, we actually almost won. So they they had to draw all four counter spells. Which obviously they drew half their they drew over half their deck, so sure, but that wasn't actually, you know, as bad as it looked. Alright, now we have all of our bane fires. We bring in our Carnage Tyrants, we bring in our Sorcerer Spyglasses, and our Scavengers, I think. We cut the lightning strikes, and we cut the territorial allosauruses. And What else do we cut? Cut a land, maybe. I never hate cutting a land. I'm a draw. Oh, I'm on the, on the play. Never mind. I only have one field in this deck. I should gotta cut cut a fight. Fight a fire kills Lyra, which is pretty important. Um, I don't think we want the uh, canopies. Let's cut. Um, we have four commune. 22 lands and 4 commune. Yeah, I'm cool with that. 
Now, Five of Fire is much better because it kills Lyra. Maybe that's wrong. I'm not sure. Let's try this. Sword Tooth is a whole deck. The whole point of a deck is Sword Tooth. Alright, let's go. Yikes. We can't keep this. Alright, this is fine. Again, this is version 3 of this list. I'm not sure if this version is actually good or not. But I wanted to try a more dino-centric list. Previous list only had 4 Sawtooth and 4 Frenzy for dinosaurs. I think that list might be better, but... Alright, we're on the play. I'm just going to... So we have turn we have forest, then thunderherd. I guess commune's like a guaranteed land. Alright, we'll put that on top. Alright, so migrate, get a mountain, play scavenger. Next turn we can go commune for land, play scavenger. Could my map also, honestly. Might just my map. We'll see what they do. Better be a land if he's top five. Alright, so let's get this mountain. Yeah, I'm just gonna play the uh the map, I think. I don't think playing a scavenger into the removal spell here or essence scatter is worth it. Let's get our map going, try and flip our map. Wow. Rude. I tap bad too. That's such shitty. I didn't think they had negate in their deck. That's pretty wild. Alright, I tap bad. I should cast I should cast commune, obviously. Field of ruin. Alright. Playing a land plays around uh, around syncopate. I, I guess negate makes sense. All I saw was fight with fires for the most part. We're gonna eat this. Play commune. All right, sword tooth it is. Duncan Dinos. Ooh, they missed a land drop. Alright, so. Hmm, interesting. Six, seven, eight, nine. We're not there yet. Harry 13. Negate seems good against us, but we're, but we're, we're more... Di I guess they don't know that we're more dinosaur-centric. Alright. Let's just, just go nuts here. If they have Deafening Clarion, I mean... I think it's fine. Splash for blue for our own negates? Might be a thing. Like, we're playing a lot of creatures, you know? Lightning Strike, a Scavenger, sure. That's good. Means I don't have Clarion. Swordtooth was definitely better in our last deck because we had we had more things like, um... Uh, what's it called? The... The one three... The, the Groot. The one three that looks at our top card, uh, Green Seeker, which finds more lands for Swordtooth. Uh, we had more maps. So Sword Tooth is definitely better in that deck. All 
Alright. Just ship. Other deck definitely more dynamic. Dinosaurs are a little more one dimensional. They have another lightning strike. Alright. I mean, that's fine. I don't always see a reason to field yet. Yeah, we're, we're super dead this game. They just have six spells in their hand. And we just have actual nothing. Yeah, making our opponents removal good kind of sucks, honestly. They're just going to cast a card draw spell here. We're just going to lose. Like, normally these our opponents' lightning strikes and stuff and justice strikes don't look very good against us. We're just doing other things. But, yeah, this, 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 this deck is definitely much, much worse against control decks. Like, we've got nothing here. We are we just have stone nothing to their seven guards. Yeah. Perhaps today is a good day to die. Thanks for following him. If you haven't followed, if you haven't followed the stream, hit that follow button, of course. Holy Cats, Mario, Cam, King, Stalking Vulture. Thanks for following everyone. Appreciate it. I mean... Maybe we'll draw Banefire and Lens. Oh, Teferi. Teferi, Teferi, Teferi. It's eight cards, Insight and Graveyard. It's literal everything. That's not the worst. We can just kill that. Unless they have a Counterspell. I mean, that's pretty good. I mean, this this might bait a counter spell, honestly. Hey, Flash, one of your All right, could be worse. We're one short of sword tooth attacking, unfortunately. Star of extinction. We gotta play Star of Extinction in a dinosaur deck? That's just cruel. That's just the biggest flavor fail of all time. They tucked our dinosaur and they play a search for Escanta. We have our own field. They should probably field us. Nope. Okay. Commune with dinosaurs. Okay. Just what I always wanted. Another dinosaur. How to solve your problems? Draw more dinosaurs. Carnage Tyrant is not bad. That is a good one. If you're looking for a good one, that's the one you're looking for, I guess. Uh, these decks don't play Wraths, I don't think. Um, maybe they do. They like might play like two. I mean, we're attacking, so it's not really uh anything crazy here. Some play like two settle or two wrath. Oh god, they have a wrath. It's so sick. So sick. If you're just doing it, welcome to the stream. It's our third version of um of Duncan Dinos. This is a version playing a lot of dinosaurs. I'm not su super thrilled about this version. I did want to try it out though. Um, I think the version with less dinosaurs is better. You're kind of seeing why right now. This is just like, we are just getting destroyed by Essence Scatter, Lightning Strike, Wrath of God. Like, it just it's a much less dynamic deck than our previous version. Why would they field our land like this? Like, we have a map and a field. It's very peculiar. I'm just not going to scry, because we, we're going to search, search for land, sure. Right. I mean, we do have bane fire and stuff in our deck, you know, like... Which way is the advantage bar pointing? Huh. Like, I'm not saying we're a favorite or nothing, but... We do have bane fire in our deck, and they are 12. And they're not really any closer to ultimating the fairy or killing us or anything. Ixalan's Binding, that's a tilt. Okay. 
I mean, they usually have two Cleansing Nova, if that. I mean, between Ascanta and Deferi and stuff, they probably could find it, but... We got our Banefires. Carney T. We're talking about back in five minutes. Just wait longer. Now what? Play the X spell for what? Th X is uh. X is two. Okay. Carnity is back, and they have to find a Cleansing Nova. Suppose Lyra isn't the end of the world. Lyra buys them enough time. Maybe. Oh my god. Mission briefing. That card's terrible. Alright. That's probably going to do it. We have no Carney T's left. Um, we have seven. We have eight lands and Banefires in our deck. I don't think we uh, can find enough mana before you get to fairy ultimated we should, we should drop back to back bane fires or frenzy i wonder if this is going to resolve or not i should have field of ruin first that was dumb nah they probably said negator stroke anyway all right whatever Mission Briefing is mildly playable. It is not good. It's like Snapcaster, but better. That is a bold statement. Shall I? They have the Angel Package on the board, right? All right, well, let's just go run around our, ba run around our Banefire, right? That's not a Banefire. I wonder if this is going to resolve. This is our first match. Our first match. I think that this deck is significantly worse against control than our previous version as we're playing all the dinosaurs and we're seeing that full frontal here uh, we're going to concede we have no we have no outs anymore can't, we can't even bane fire them save shalai yeah we have no outs all right um so yeah so if you're sitting in welcome this is a third version of duncan dinos i want to try a version with uh commune dinosaurs and thunder herd migration and then Regisaur Alpha to give our dinosaurs haste off of our Frenzy. I think this version is probably worse, but I wanted to try it because you can never know unless you try it. Um, this version is significantly worse against Control than our other version. Uh, we beat multiple Control decks with our other version, which is uh, the original version here, based more on just not playing a lot of dinosaurs, um, playing Atlanta Elves and Dryad Greenseeker and uh, Treasure Map. More removal and then more focus on getting the engine online. But that's okay. We're trying it out. You can't know until you try. Justice Strike is very, very good. Very, very good. If you can cast it, obviously. Alright. Um, I think that's good. This is kind of what we were looking for. Commune, Thunderherd. This is our plan. Oh god, more steam vents? Alright, Commune. I'm trying to land here. That's, all, that's our only options anyway, so... Alright, so we have, we have Rampant Growth into... Oh god, come on. You know... We're running pretty bad with our matchups today. I'm not gonna lie. Let's reveal the sword tooth. Our previous deck was all removal spells. Couldn't beat a Danto Vanguard, and we played against Danto Vanguard over and over again. This version probably can't beat Control. Should play against Control two 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 games in a row. Bounce spells are good against us. Yes, we lost to the spell deck because they they bounced us a few times. Alright, so let's cast this again. 
See if they'll counter it, because they think we're mana screwed. God, we're so good. We're so good. God damn. Get rid of an Iron Eyes is so good. Alright, um... Death Gorge, Regisaur, or Brontodon. Brontodon survives Lightning Strike and Justice Strike. So Brontodon's pretty cool. Um, a second Regisaur Alpha is also pretty exciting, though, because it's just so powerful. But much softer to counter spells. We have baited out another counter spell. Um, version 2, what was different? Uh, we're playing Shocks over Kitu Fire, playing a second Field of Ruin, um, playing more maps. Not playing Siege Gang, Spyglass in the board, Canopy in the board. Spyglass and Canopy were, were both really good. Uh, not too, not too different, but that video, that video will be on YouTube. If you missed it. Um, so yeah, Brontodon's some nice pressure though. Yeah, I don't want too many expensive cards. We we just want to cast Frenzy. I think Frenzy is definitely a little worse in this deck too because um, they just. We just have more expensive things. It's hard. It's harder to empty our hand. Uh, the previous decks had more removal spells and shocks and stuff. It was easier just to like throw a bunch of cards out. All right. Um, all right. We're gonna bronze it on. Like normally here, we, we, in our old deck, we would slam sword tooth and try and get frenzy in play, but we have more things to do as far as like playing big dumb idiots. So sure. Lava Coil? Ugh. Ooh, boy. Search for Ascanta? It's Alpha Time. Alpha Time. Giant Bower seems bad. It draws cards to your hand. It don't matter. It only casts your, your instants and sorcery. It just doesn't seem very good at all. Alright, I mean, we're going to cast it's 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. We're one short. Ugh. We're going to cast Sword Tooth. Oh, it's 10. We have, we have, we have a land, so. Yeah. They could have Settle the Wreckage, but if they do, we get the post-combat Frenzy and get a bunch of lands in play, and I think that's fine. So... Frenzy plus lands is great. They'd have to have Settle plus a way to deal with Frenzy. And I think both those are not likely, so let's just ship it. Alright, this is fine. Are they a blink of an eye? This card's so good against us. Why is everyone playing this card? Alright, I mean, this will take like a million here. Maybe we should just play Frenzy. Lightning Strike on top? That's pretty dope. Looks like we got him this game. Yeah, it's no longer pre-football. We have passed into the point of being in the middle of football. So I am missing football for you fine folks, all right? I got a DraftKings lineup. I got a fantasy team. I got football to watch. This is my day off. And here I am streaming for you fine folks on the interwebs. Thanks for tuning in. We have over 1,200 awesome viewers. That's why I'm here. I'm here for you fine folks. This is what I do full-time. This is my gig. So if you haven't followed, stream with that follow button, of course. Watching on YouTube, make sure you follow on there. We're going to upkeep strike, yes. Sweet. Dad, what's up, my friend? Welcome. Gave up football for you folks. All right. I mean, this looks like they're super dead here. Yeah, there's dead, so. First time YouTube viewers. Yeah, this is not my usual time slot. Um, I'm obviously usually on during the week, during the day. So um, a lot of YouTube viewers. That was pretty cool. We won the game. All right, so uh, let's bring in our spy glasses and our Carnage Tyrants. Scavenger. Gain Fires. And last time we cut, what, the strikes? Strike, 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 strike. We cut the territorial owl sources and we cut a land, right? Now they're on the, now they're on the draw, I definitely want to cut a land, so. Looks good to me. Y'all, awesome. Raise your hand in chat if you have football on one screen and me on the other screen. Because that'd be dope. Re uh, that's, that's, a new, that's a resub. 2,000, you've subbed before, I know you. 2,000, welcome back, my friend. 
Everyone show some love and chat for our, our returning sub. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Opponent says, I had Niv and two Clarions in my hand. You want a medal? What do you want from me? Niv Mizzet is actually really good. Maybe we'd be bored and answer to Niv Mizzet. We have Fight with Fire. It's fine. I would never watch football. Welcome back. All right, we'll take take a short second here to take our, our fantasy team. Now we're back now. Oh, this hand's terrible. Xenomorphic, new subs. Xenomorphic, what's your name? Where are you from? Questions are in chat. How are we doing so far? Real quick. We are not even playing yet. And their team is doing good. They have Matt Ryan and Julio Jones. Eh, that's scary. That's scary. All right. Uh, yeah, we got to mulligan this one. Obviously, it's just all ends. This is not great, but it's a keep. Uh, football. Um, Miz says, Red Zone on one stream, me on another, and Fantasy Scoreboards on the third. That's a good Sunday. Yes, I'm looking forward to having my living room set up where I have multiple TVs with um, fantasy scores on one, games on the other. I'm pretty stoked. John, thanks for the bits. Appreciate that. All right. Um, I want the alpha. Like, if we draw spells instead of lands, it's fine. You know? New subs, hop on the Discord. Sarge, resub. Yo 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 yo. Yo 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 yo. Yeah, no um, no arena yet for this. I don't have the cards for it yet. I have been playing arena though. So, all right. Their hand is ionize, ionize, land, land, land to ferry. I wonder what we're gonna name. Trophy. All right. So they have double counter spell, but not much else. Glacial Fortress. And we start playing... The Scavengers are not very good in this matchup in particular. But... They seem good in other matchups. This deck actually competitive. I would say the Dinosaur version is pretty iffy. But the version I was playing previously I think is competitive, yes. How competitive? I'm not sure if it's all the way there yet. But it does seem powerful. Kyle! Steam vents. Alright. Carney T. Alright. We're slam jamming. It's also kind of nice that this version of a deck, the dinosaurs can get in early damage, so only one bane fire is necessary. Um, which is kind of a thing. So we're playing this here. They're probably going to counter it, which is fine. Um, that's cool. Draw an Iron Eyes. We still have a threat in play. And our hand is obviously pretty, pretty big. We can see, though, how, like, Frenzy doesn't look very good with these cards, kind of. So we're, we're, you know. All right, Xenomorphic is Michael from Dallas. and playing about three years. Getting back in. Favorite card is Hypothesis. Favorite deck is Just Guy Counterburn. Sweet, my friend. Welcome. Well, I see you at the Open in Dallas. They played a Sulphur Falls that's not on their hand. So they have Ionize, Island, Retreat, Teferi, X. So we draw a land, we're just going to slam Alpha. So we can just go back-to-back -back Jacks on the Alphas. Read your map. That's fun. Yes, please. Take four. Map. They might counter this. Probably not, but it is very good. No. Okay. So now we're looking for a land on top. I just want to cast alphas if possible. They are they seem to be breaking off a little bit, which is good. They haven't drawn a, a draw two and they can't cast a fairy because we have the spyglass. Oh god. Alright, Nivmiss is pretty good. Uh our cards do not line up well against Nivmiss it. Melvin. Thanks for following everyone. Forest on top. 
think we top this, just get the alpha in play. And then we'll just try and play a hasted Carnage Tyrant next turn. This is bad, though. Uh, Nib is really good against us. You know, we don't have an answer yet. Sweet. Who else am I going to see in Dallas this weekend? Yeah, Nib Miss, it's really... This card is really, really, really good. Really good. Alright, there's the islands. Their hand is Ionized to Fairy Card Card. Ixalan's Binding on Regisaur Alpha. What a tilt. Alright, we're drawing. Alright, I mean, obviously Carney T lines up pretty well here. And they, they if they want to Wrath it, they obviously have to kill their Nib Mizzet also. So, I would have loved for this to have haste, but it's not the end of the world. Dragons are dinosaurs with wings. That's that's true. Um, if they have settle, they have settle. I can't. There's not much I can do here. We can't. The longer this game goes on, the worse things get for us. So uh, we're gonna scry here. Upkeep. So there's Fight with Fire. The problem is we know they have Ionize in their hand. So if we cast Fight with Fire, they're just going to draw extra cards, which is bad. Um, I think we just bottom this. Honestly. I just don't think it matters. Alright. Carney T is coming in. I mean, it, if they have Settle here, they have Settle. What else am I hoping to draw? Banefire, uh, more treasure maps. Disenchant for this thing. Like, obviously disenchanting the Ixalan's Binding is really great because we'll get Alpha back at a token. So, you know, our deck has three Banefires in it. So, we can't cast Redistore. It's under Binding. All right, their hand is ionized. To fair. They, just took, they just took damage. Oh, no, they have that card. What do they have here? Oh, Teferi doesn't do anything. Oh, I got to counter it? They're going to Disdainful Stroke their own Teferi to just draw a card and deal damage to something. This is wild. Wow, we actually won. So, Carnage Tyrant's not usually good against the blue-white control decks, but against these new Jeskai decks, Carnage Tyrant's pretty good. All right. Sweet. You folks tuning in, welcome to the stream. My name is Jim Davis. Great stream so far today. And uh, we're one and one. This is a much more dinosaur heavy version of Dunkin' Dinos. Um, I don't think this deck is great. This is an experiment. Um, we're playing less treasure maps, less Groots, less Llanowar Elves, and more dopey dinosaurs. Um, but the frenzies, are, like, the frenzies are definitely worse in this deck than they are in the other deck. Our other version of the deck was much more frenzy centric. Um, this deck's a little more mid rangey, but hey, we're one on one, so cool. If you haven't followed the stream, hit that follow button, of course. Uh, I'm gonna keep. I don't love it, but I'm gonna keep. Like the five five or four seems awkward against next to frenzy, you know. Gain much from playing white? I don't think so. Definitely experimental. Definitely experimental. Everybody do the dinosaur. God, I steam vents that again? It never ends. Please play a creature next turn or something. If they're playing just guy again. I mean, our hand is. Oh, God. Our hand is terrible against this. All right, I'm gonna cast Migration. I'm not casting the creature into this. They play the land untapped. Literally any spell they would play would kill the scavenger. So there's no point in playing scavenger here. I do need the land though, so we're gonna. I'm just gonna cast it full full Monty, I guess, right? I don't think gold is good in this deck, though. Excellent. 
three Just Guy decks in a row. Three. Count them three. Okay. Um, I'm just going to play a 5-5 five five here, I guess. Maybe we can double spell the following turn. Probably not, but whatever. We're just baiting a counter spell at this point. I mean, they could have, they have Essence Scatter, they have Justice Strike, Lightning Strike, like, yeah, like, anything in the world kills this thing, so... Maybe we cast Frenzy this turn, because if they counter it, who cares? If they don't counter it, great. And if um, if they don't counter it, we draw a land next turn. We can go. We can double spell on Scavenger and Frenzy. Melvin. Yeah, I think I like that actually. It's also their their card draw turn. Let's cast Frenzy here. If it resolves, fantastic. If it resolves, and they Teferi it. We can kill it to Ferry. Yeah, this is good. This is a good duress here. I, I, I like this play. How good is Demir against the current Jeskai decks? I'm not sure. Fight with fire. Guilt. Uh, feels bad. I mean, they have to have another Ionize to counter the Frenzy. Let's just go for it. Again, if they counter it, we still have spells in our hand. Alright, resolved. Top card's Frenzy. It's not good, but that's fine. Pretty happy to have Frenzy in play, at least. Obviously, our hand is stuck now, but if Frenzy's in play, we should be in good shape. So don't cast Nimbus. They can't cast Nimbus. It's sweet. And if it's a fairy, it's actually great. Cleansing Nova. That's cool. That's a card I did not think of. That works. Now we just cast it again. We have one on top, so... Nova's good. This card's good. I played this on my blue white deck, and I did kill uh, a good amount of um, a good amount of en artifacts and enchantments with it. Thunder herd off the top, shuffle, get a mountain, top card land, cool, and land. All right. They got five cards in hand. Now what? Again, they have to ferry, and they want to want to minus on the frenzy. We just have a a lightning strike. Main main phase insight. All right, this feels pretty good for us. What's up, Mad Duffy? Welcome, my friend. Land up the top and land. All right. I mean, any anytime Frenzy's in play, we're happy. So, upstairs, map is the nut. Scry bottom. Oh, they're digging. All right. So everything we're doing right now is things that the the old deck would be doing as well. Almost better, honestly. Uh, that's that's fine. Essence scatter, sure. All right, this is fine. We get to put the main fire safely into our hand and kill them with it later. It's fun. And again, we have lightning strike for a Teferi if they kill our frenzy, so. Everybody do the dinosaur. There's Teferi, sure. Um, we have 5, 10. We can main fire for 10 next turn. It's not even close to enough. So we're going to, um, we're going to strike the Teferi. It might kill it. This is fine. 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 Sunday. You're allowed to day drink on Sunday. It's fine. Blink of an eye. Bounce the Teferi. Sure. 
Okay, so... Now I get to cast Scavenger. Actually, I just fight, we just fight with fire, never mind. Give him the old fight with fire. Give him the old upstairs for 10 ball. Hi, Jim. Would love for a deck tech on my experimental frenzy modern deck. Seems Glory. appropriate today. Thanks, Glory. Glory, send, send, send the link in chat, my friend. We'll do it after, after, after this league, all right? And then, um, yeah, we're good to go here. This game was going bad. I mean, again, our dinosaurs have looked pretty bad in this matchup, but the core engine is good, so. Upstairs. Teferi. Oh, they're dead. They are dead. Restore alpha, sure, whatever. Doesn't matter. Can I get an upstairs in chat? Get your upstairs ready. Please. Thank you. Oh, do you can. How's that feel? Does it feel good? A little tickly bane fire? A little tickly bane fire? If you're not a sub, that's your own fault. That's not my fault, all right? Opponent quietly rages themselves for a bit, then concedes. Thanks for following up. If you haven't followed that follow button, of course. We're bringing the same things you brought in the last two matches. So you're playing against us like three times now. Uh, got the Allosaurus, the Allosaurus, four lightning strikes, and a land. The deck list is right here, my friend. We have we have a deck list function thing on the overlay. You can check that out. Also, just uh, do that too. That's what you get. When you're playing counter spells, a little bane fire. What's up, Cody? Yes, again, this is version three. I still think that this version is better. Uh, maybe not with Karn, but the version has more focus on frenzy. But dinosaurs are doing some work right now, honestly. While waiting for our opponent, remind everyone to hop on Twitter and give me a follow at Jim Davis MTG. Give me a follow. Going for ten thousand followers for the year. Get followed all the news when I'm streaming and deck lists and hypothesis shizzle, insta the rizzle dizzle, stuff like that. Lots of fun. Also follow my team, team BCW at team underscore BCW. We do an event before every single open on the Star City uh, tour, SCG tour. We'll be, we'll be at one in Dallas this weekend. Where's it going to be? Follow the uh, follow Twitter to find out. Check it out. All right. This hand is fine. We can keep this. It's not great, but it, we have Spyglass and Lands and Frenzy. I think I think Scavenger is fine. Maybe the um, whatever migration. That's the first time we haven't had a, a thing for that. Squid Squad. I didn't steal nothing. I retweeted that. A retweet is uh, me saying it's someone else's. You know. All right. So that's fun. A little Carney T action. We gotta reveal the current T to our opponent, but it's fine. No, I misclicked. Oh, I did it. Oh no. Wise man say. You failed the find. Oh. It's okay. It's alright. It's alright. Everyone can yell at me in chat now. Throw tomatoes at me and stuff like that. Yeah, that's 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 a really bad one. That's really really rough. All right. Um, I do kind of miss arena. Arena the uh, that would never happen on arena, you know, because the the interface is just so much cleaner. It would never give you a chance to do it like that. All right. Um, Insight Nova. Explosion, Justice Strike, Sulphur Falls. So they can Nova away the Spyglass anyway. Oh man, Nova's really good against this hand. Um, Nova's good against everything we have. Jeez. You blow it. Alright. We're still aiming to Fairy, I guess. They're not even close to turning on Search for Escanta, so... Give me sugar and water. 
That's tough. That is tough. That's a tough one. It's okay. We're good. It's not like we're playing a terrible matchup and I just threw away a card and revealed a card for no reason. All right? That definitely didn't just happen. Everything's going to be okay. Dog's barking again outside like it always does. So we cast Frenzy and get blown up by the Wrath. However, if we make them use their Wrath now, then our Tyrant's good later. I think we just slam Frenzy here, honestly. Like, this is also their card draw turn, too. I should, I, never mind, they're going to do it anyway. It's not kind of spells, whatever. But, we'll just play this. They'll play the Wrath. We we alpha them. And then, they're going to counter it? All right, sure. That's fine, too. So, them, so they, they they drew that card. That was their, that was their draw for turn. Um, and now, they have no counter spell. And we can just alpha them next turn. Which is fine. Alright, tap land. So they have Insight, Expel, Strike, Nova. That's a good draw. They can strike the Alpha, and we can't attack, but then they can't cast the card draw spell, which is really important, so... Alright, they cast the card draw spell. So now we have... A significant board presence. Um, we have Carney T in hand. We have a Frenzy also and a Fight with Fire. Those are less important, but the Frenzy is still fine. They have a Nova, but the Nova is really taxed because Nova either kills Spyglass and Frenzy or kills our creatures. They got to deal with these things because they're actually killing them. And Nova is the only answer to Carnage Tyrant as well. So... Duncan Dinos. Alright, there's your Justice Strike. Okay. So, now what? We definitely open on the attack. And then we need to decide, do we, would, we, would we rather have a Frenzy in play, and a Spyglass in play, or a Carnage Tyrant in play? We can slam Carney T here, they'll Wrath, and then we get to slam Frenzy. And the Frenzy's probably safe. So the question is, what's more important? We could also play Frenzy here. They have a card draw against that, but instead they can Insight. What is more valuable? That's true. Nova also kills the Red Scanta. That is true. That is true. That's an important one. All right. I'm sold. I'll play Frenzy. There's not much we can actually hit off the Frenzy in play, but... All right. So land on top. We still, we still wanted to play our lands. It's fine. Uh, yeah. All right. They can copy Cleansing Nova. They can, but... Alright, they discard a planes, they cast the thing. Yeah, that I think them having to destroy their own search with Nova is pretty big. They have six cards in hand. They have a lot. They can kill this dinosaur with the, the X spell, but we should hope our frenzy's good, I think. Oh, they're what they're one short of copying anyway. Yeah, never, never not. Oh, I'm sorry, they can't they, it doesn't copy stuff. This is a new card, I'm not sure what it does. Copy things cost four or less, sure. That's a pretty good one, honestly. Um, I'm pretty down with that. Let's tack. Start there. Lebrontodon, James, Forrest. Lebrontodon, J. Essence Scatter, sure. Play land. Commune with Dinosaurs is not very good with Frenzy. This is definitely a much worse Frenzy deck. Um, I would say Frenzy is definitely a lot worse than this deck than our other, our other deck. 
Which concerns me because dinosaurs isn't very good by itself. So, like, we're going to commune here. And whatever we get, we can't play. So, Ingram is out. What? Toots? I guess we put Sword Tooth in our hand. Which is just better if they kill a thing. Op card is Frenzy again. Yuck. All right. Vance's Blasting Cannons? No. Again, the whole point is Sword Tooth plus Frenzy. If you, if you, you haven't seen the previous videos, you missed out. Um, original list looks like this. It's a much dry, dry Green Seeker, Lana or Elves, four, four maps, more removal. We're just trying a dinosaur heavy version because it finds Sword Tooth better, but the cards are more expensive, so I don't know. This might not be right. All right, so top card, Mountain, Forest. We also have three Bane Fires in our deck, so that's a thing too. All right, they're probably gonna Nova next turn because they want to flip their search, and then we can slam Carney T. Also, have Fight with Fire too, so they could just be dead. Evan Ingram is not my... Eric Ebron is in DraftKings. Are they going to use their thing? Okay. That's fine. Quit this lead. No, we already ran the old list. We're, right, we're trying a new one now. All right. Um, so we're saying go here. Because we, can, we obviously can't cast that yet. But So now they have the opportunity to... Cleansing Nova away our Spyglass and our Frenzy... We got Carney T and Fight with Fire, so. They have seven cards in hand, and Ascanta. And Lyra. Lyra is a problem. Fuck, I meant to possibly blow up the Frenzy. Okay, that's an issue. So, top card, Forest. Next card, another Frenzy. Oh, come on. I probably should have popped the Frenzy end step. I think. Once they played Lyra, I think I'd, I'd already F6, but I think that once they played Lyra, it's time to cast our Carnage Tire and our Fight with Fire. Um, now we're in a really awkward spot. <sighs> they still have the Nova in their hand, too. Play a land already. All right, we're gonna pop this. Not be thrilled about it. They still have Nova in their hand for Carney T. Also, so it's not like we're, you know, we're off on that. And now, if we cast the Sword Tooth, they let it resolve. We can go land, fight with fire, but if they don't, ugh, this is, is kind of gross. They almost assuredly have a counter spell here too. All right. I don't like this at all. This is the game we missed with our, our Thunder Herd on turn two. So this game would have been, been a lot easier if we had the extra land in play. They also know we have this because of that too. All right, that, that's not bad. All right, we're still playing. They're at 11. We still have Bane Fires in our deck. They're not gaining any life, which is good. We're still playing. They incited. Incited over Escanta. I think it's better to Escanta there. Alright, so we are free from the Frenzy. We're going to play Sword Tooth and play another Frenzy. I'm gonna play one land from my hand and then cast this. So if I hit a land on top, I can still clear it. Version two, we went two, three, but I don't think our record was indicative of how good the deck was. 
Um, we lost to a Danto Vanguard a lot. We lost to, to a really weird blue-red Phoenix deck. Um, I think our matches were pretty awkward, and we lost a lot of close games. So I don't think the 2-3 was indicative of our, our record in the previous league. Invoke the Divine. That's tilt. Fight with Fire. Uh, we can't cast that. Pink Eye Pie. What's up, my friend? New sub. What's your name? Where are you from? I should put this land. I don't know. Pink Eye Pie. What's your name? Where are you from? Questions are in chat. Welcome, my friend. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for subbing. Appreciate that. That's an Amazon Prime sub. Don't forget, if you're uh, an Amazon Prime user, you are also a Twitch Prime user. You get free subs every month. Use them on me. Thank you. Also, all new subs, private Discord chat server. All right, there's Teferi. They still have the Wrath. We still have Carnage Tyrant. So we're in a little bit of a game of chicken here with that. They're going to put our Dinosaur in our deck? Sure. Hey. <laughs> Leg, another new sub. Same questions, my friend. Welcome. All right, Sword Tooth. How about another Sword Tooth? We had a land clump here. We're going nuts. Land, land, Thunder Herd migration. All right. Maybe this time we'll actually uh, get the land. We didn't do that last time. We cast it, then I hit OK for some reason. Bobo, another sub. Twitch Prime is going nuts. Thanks, everyone. I appreciate it so much. Once again, welcome, welcome, welcome. What's your name? Where are you from? Questions are in chat. Please at me in chat. We have a lot of, a lot of viewers right now, so I might, I might miss your uh, thing. Commune clears the top card. It's not ideal, but Commune definitely not good synergy with the other card. Um, I would like the Scavenger in our hand. Oh, wait. Uh... At each card at the bottom. Yeah, oops. Andrew from British Columbia. Playing since 96. Favorite card, Figure of Destiny. Favorite deck is Affinity. Uh, puppy named Karn. Andrew, thank you, my friend. Appreciate it. Registore Alpha on top. That is not castable at the moment. That's fine. All right. Maybe we have two five fives in play. Still got Frenzy going. We're still, still working up to our Bane Fires. We also have quite the hand if uh, we need to crack the frenzy or the frenzy dies. Justice strike. Okay. For those who don't know, um, my fiance and what do they do? I should record. My fiance and my stepson want a dog really bad. I don't really want a dog. But I told them if we got a thousand subs, I get him a dog. We're at 551. We're over halfway there. So thanks to all your support and torturing me and getting me a dog that I don't really want. Appreciate that very much. Zerglings. All right, they're killing one of my things. It's fine. We will find Banefire eventually, and we will kill them with it. So we have three Bane Fires in our deck and 29 cards left. And we're going to see a lot of cards over the next many, many turns. All right, draw. Death Gorge Scavenger. They have an Insight in their graveyard. Sure, it's cool. Another Death Gorge Scavenger. Sir, hit the Insight. Making them waste mana here is nice, too. They want to cast it in response. All right, cool. Eat that. Scavenger. Eat, uh... I don't think it matters anymore, but we'll eat the split card. And a mountain. And another sword tooth. Sure. Commune with dinosaurs again. <laughs> Great. The frenzy's real. Bobo from Philly. There's a bane fire. All right, so we gotta put this. We gotta stack this properly. So the first card I click goes in the bottom, and the next card goes under it. I assume. So the first one we gotta click click is, is a a bane fire. Click bane fire. Now let's go one, two, three. New sub, Ram. What's up, Ram? Um, a map is great. Another map is good too. Just cast that one. 
And Carney T is on top. Alright, I gotta put this here, I guess. Um, now we're gonna attack. We attack them or Teferi? Probably them. I guess. Oops, no. I mean, it's to, I mean, it doesn't really matter, honestly. Like, we, we just need to find Banefire and kill them. I guess Fight with Fire is lethal if we attack them. We have so much stuff in our hand. I'm going to attack the fairy. Probably going to die no matter what I do, so. I also could just have another Teferi, which is fine, but whatever. The thing is that, like, they, their Cleansing Nova has to kill my Carnage Tyrants. And we have all the stuff in play. Oh, boy, what is this? They're going to seven ball us. All right, we got to gain some life with these scavengers next turn. The second scavenger should, should have gained life. That was a mistake. There was no reason to exile some random card. I should have just gained life. That was definitely a mistake. Bobo um, from Philly. Sweet. Favorite card, Nicol Bolas. Favorite card, Legacy Dredge. Playing since 2010. Puppy named Charizard. Bobo, thanks, my friend. I appreciate it. Got a lot of viewers today. A lot of great viewers. Give yourself a hand. You're all awesome. Clarion deals three damage to each creature. Sure. I guess two Clarions kills Tyrant too, so I assume they have two here. They wouldn't cast they wouldn't just cast one. Okay. Um Carney T is going to go where? We could scry. We can just draw it into our hand. We can put it safely in the bottom of our deck. A lot of options here. Hi, Super Nintendo Chalmers. I'm gonna... Let me just draw it, I guess. If our, if our next card is Banefire, I'll be really dumb, so... Scavenger's great. I'm cool with that. Put this somewhere I can see it more easily. And we're gonna gain some life. I don't care about the, I don't care about these insights anymore. They can just cast it response. I just don't care. They have search for Escanta. They have multiples. Just gain some life. I should move Lyra probably. Whatever. Just not get fireballed out here. Play land. Lebrontodon James. Sure. Sorcerer Spyglass. That's pretty good. Field of Ruin. Also good. We'll see if they respond to Ascanta. I'm going to name... Do I name Ascanta or Teferi here? Now we have Field of Ruin? I think I just named, I just named Teferi. Their hand is... Ah, crap. I just deleted it. Their hand is Teferi, Teferi, Negate, Plains, Fireball, Nova, Blink. They have 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. They have 12 mana. They can Fireball for 8. So we got to be aware of that. We cannot get Fireball. We have to try and win the game before they Fireball us. They have Teferi's in their hand. I'm going to name Teferi. Oh, I don't, have enough, I don't have any more land drops. I'm dumb. I thought I thought I, thought I had a guy in play. Uh, let's see. Do we scry here? Top card, Rootbound Greg, Scry. Sweet. I mean, all right, there's the Bane Fire. We found it. We found it. So we need. Now, obviously, unfortunately, it's going to be drawn into our hand. So we got to pop our thing first. But we're pretty close to killing them here. I forgot their hand already because I I had closed it by accident. But this is a pretty easy slam jam, I think. The hand was like negate to fairy to fairy expel blink of an eye, right? Blink of an eye. That's the one. All right. They has Kanta. Just gotta get him before they fireball us twice. That's the important part. They find a second fireball here, we're in trouble. A uh, strike in Nova, right?
And again, they also have to deal with... Alright, they found a Clarion. They have to deal with these creatures, too. Alright, discard um, a land, a Frenzy... Okay. Yeah, Blink of an Eye is very good against it. We played against Blink of an Eye a lot. Um, I don't think this card is particularly great well, in general, but it is very, very good against us. This is like a medium answer to stuff. Alright, well, they gotta kill our stuff in play. And... Frenzy's dope. Frenzy's really, really good. Oh, the Brontodon can kill Frenzy. Good thinking. If they don't kill the Brontodon, I like that. Let's see what they do here. They can always Clarion and then Justice Strike this. Oh, they, they, they use Strike, right? No, they, they use Blink. Alright, that, that should be game. So, untap. We draw. Top card is Reach Store Alpha. So we have 9... 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. We're one short. We're short. We have, um, we need one mana for Brontodon. And then one, we have one mana for X. That's 10. We only have 14. We're one short. We gotta keep playing. Yeah, I counted the, I counted the land and end. Oh, wait, I guess attacking works? Sure. Alright, let's do that then. If we attack, then we can't reach our Alpha. Are we sure we want to do that? To I think so. What's their hand? Negate, to fairy, to fairy, wrath, expel. All right, let's attack. Now the maps are short. The maps are only on one. All right, and that's the game, folks. Yes, Don. Every time I stream this deck, people scream all the time. Why don't you play the cards in your hand? Play this card. Play that card. Play this card. Upstairs. Oh, you can. We beat two control decks. That's pretty sweet. Beating control seems hard. Never trust chat. I don't know what instant speed life gain they could have, so... They can't copy it because it's mana cost four or five or greater. Duncan Dinos. Yeah, Banefire. Well, I don't know why, why it passed priority back to me. That's not, that's not how magic works, but still Banefire. Still Banefire. Dirt Key. Thanks for subbing, my friend. What's your name? Where are you from? Oh, Invoked a Divine. Oh, yeah. Oh, I would have been super awkward if they Invoked a Divine. I did not consider that at all. We, we knew their hand, kind of. But if they had drawn it in like a turn or two, they could have found it. Yeah. That is, that is, that's a thing. Okay. Well, maybe we played bad, but who cares? We won anyway. If you're tuning in, welcome to the stream. My name's Jim Davis. We almost 1,500 viewers. I think it's the most viewers I've ever had in my entire life. Give yourself a hand. You're all fantastic. Burnsy, there's almost 1,500 people watching you lick yourself right now. I'm sorry, Burns. It's bath time. I'm I'm sorry, man. We're two one. We're playing Duncan Dinos. This is the this is the heavy dinosaur version, version three of the deck. Um, we actually just beat two control decks, and I'm I'm s stunned after that after that first loss against Jess Guy. I thought we like probably just couldn't win that matchup, and we've beaten it twice now. So, Rodzilla, new sub, Twitch Prime. What's your name? Where are you from? Questions are in chat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Sounds fine. And keep. Lots of viewers. Yep, no GP. Thankfully, I want to give a big th big thanks, pers personal thanks, 
to Wizards of the Coast for not covering either of their Grand Prix this weekend. Because um, because of that, I have all these viewers. I wasn't going to stream today, but I saw there was no coverage. I saw no one was on. I was like, you know what? I'll hop on. I'm going to give the people something to watch while they're watching football. You know? It's my day off, you know? Could hang out with my family, watch some football. But nope. I'm here with you fine folks. Alright, we're gonna cast this. We're gonna play the field to give them the, the, the illusion that we might be mana screwed. So maybe they will um, counter this. A lot of islands today. A lot of islands. Do I post VODs? Yes. Um, I post everything on, almost everything on YouTube. So, um... Hop on the old YouTube channel. The link's gonna be, link will be in chat. This one will be up in like... In ooh, minutes. it's the mono blue deck? Just wait longer. Is this good or bad for us? This seems bad. I don't know. Is it good? I, I don't know, honestly. I mean, that's a pretty pretty good thing. My family is kind of lame. Alright. I mean... Have syncopate, I guess. Right. Essence scatter tilt. Arena is pretty great. I don't, I don't have these cards on Arena yet, though. So, where's the YouTube link? It's in chat. Check out the YouTube. I mean, they're going to need a lot of counter spells to beat all these cards. Um, unfortunately, they're drawing a lot of cards. All right. Rodzilla's John from Nebraska. Deck is sweet. Not sure about favorite deck of all time. Playing since Origins. Favorite card might be Gonti. Karn's a pretty good puppy name. All right. They have another counter spell, too, probably. God damn it. Welcome aboard. Uh, I mean, it's just slam jam time. We could play... Actually, we could play the, the Sword Tooth and then play Map if they counter it. Yeah, I like that, actually. Okay. That's good. Waste the counter spell. Play map. Next turn we alpha them and maybe we can just race them. And they have a storm tamer. We have bane fires and our deck and stuff, right? I'll keep scry. They have seven spells in hand, probably. All right, bottom. I mean, Alpha's pretty great, and they probably can't deal with it. And it's a lot of power. So... Fight with fire is not very good, but... We're doing stuff. Right, this version is playing a lot of dinosaurs and the rampant growth and commune dinosaurs. Trickster. I mean, their their kill is slow. Um, they're not there yet, you know. All right, them playing another land sucks. They have another, they have another wizard wizard retort, retort wizards retort probably can't win. No, they have an unblockable creature. All right. That is so greedy. Why would they do that? Now I can resolve um, a fight with fire. All right, what's what's scry upkeep? Oh man, if we didn't scry, we could have played this and fought something. No. All right. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. It's okay. It's fine. It's counters abilities too. Yeah. God damn. Okay. Let's. <sighs> Man, that would have been so good. Let's bottom it, I guess. Try and draw, like... We gotta cast Fight with Fire. So, if we just draw, like, a 3-drop, we can cast it. Yeah, I'm gonna bottom it. That's a huge tilt. Alright. We're gonna slam first. Ooh. That's pretty good for us, I think. I can't believe they tapped out. Like. I 
Allosaurus seems better in spots like this. We have a lot of mana and it can kill stuff. Rip Ripjaw Raptor's like pretty medium. All right, well, we seem to be alive. We probably can't win the game, so. Nia Dinosaurs with Deafening Clarion and Ripjaw Raptor. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I think we're dead this game, folks. Hand just did not come together. Tempest Jin. What are our outs here? Uh, we attack and then Bane fire them for four, five, six, seven. So we just, because we have map flipping. Yeah, let's just scry. Lightning strike. Doesn't really do anything. We're gonna bottom that. We, 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 we draw a fight with fire, actually. All right, here it comes. Fight with fire. Treasure map. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I cast fight with fire last turn. So I just thought there was no way they would ever not leave mana op up for this again. And, like, it just gets countered. But, all right, we're dead. Um, that's fine. This matchup should be okay. It's The problem is, again, our old version would be a lot better in this matchup, too, because we just have more kill spells, you know? Instead of playing kill spells, we're playing, like, mopey dinosaur creatures. Whereas the old deck had, um, you know, Lava Coil, Lightning Strike, Shock, Fight with Fire, etc., etc. So... All right, let's bring in, um, I guess Fiery Cannonade's great. And Allosaurus seems bad. Threshing Brontodon seems also unnecessary. I want these Lava Coils. I want all the removal if possible. What else do we cut? Banefire is weird, because I feel like Banefire is actually pretty good. Maybe we just cut the fight with fires because they're easy. They're easy to counter. the The one drop counters them. They're expensive. It's worse than bane fire. Can't cut frenzy. The frenzy is the whole deck. Do I want the fourth death scourge scavenger? I don't think so. Oh, crushing canopy. Duh. Maybe we just cut all the scavengers and leave in a. Well now, but now, now our our we don't have any, any dinosaurs in our deck. We only have eight dinosaurs, so our our thunder herds are really bad. Uh, maybe we just go mono removal. Just cut all this crap. Just cut these. Put the fight with fires back in. Put the bane fire in. And then just like, maybe leave in one scavenger. I guess we don't have any other cards to take out. So we're just killing, every turn we just kill something. Lava Coil, Lightning Strike, Cannonade, Fight with Fire, um, Frenzy, Alpha, Bane Fire. I'm gonna leave in one Thunder Herd. It's just like better than all these other cards, I think. And if we don't draw a dinosaur or whatever, we have, I mean, we have, we have eight dinosaurs and four communes, so like, it's not, not insane. Carney T is like, I don't think great. Oh, they're not gonna kill Alpha, so Carney T might actually be fine. But I think it's too slow. You don't want to kill a, a one mana aura with your Brontodon. That's way too expensive and clunky. And long decks to lose to. All right, this is fine. We can keep this. Spyglass is not good on the counter guy. All right, so we get our cannonade going. Seems pretty good. We get the thunder herd. Mountain. What's up, Mr. Beardo? You folks tuning in, welcome to the stream. My name's from Davis, welcome. If it's your first time here, raise your hand in chat. Oh boy, no land, sure. I mean, no land is like a joke. Just bane fire this maybe? No, they have a cannonade. Our oh, there's a pirate. Oh no, I didn't consider that. They have pirates in their deck. How many other creatures are pirates besides Star and Storm Tamer? 
They have a. Uh, is that it? What else um, is a pirate? That's it, right? They have more pirates in the deck. They have the wizard, the djinn. It's the only one, right? That's right, the only one. It's fine. I might have Warkite Marauder. That's fine. We can deal with that. That's fine. That's fine. I'm not worried. I'm not worried. It's okay. I should have Bane fired it for one, though. That would, that would, have, been, would have been better. And they got Merfolks and... All sorts of stuff. Mulligan. Come on. Right, we have Commune, it's fine. Top card, Lava Coil, bottom. Alright, Commune, get me there. Mountain or forest? I think it's mountain. Alright, so we have removal spell, we have map. They've had, they've had stupid uh, flash creature here into the curiosity enchantment again that would suck, but they gotta have a yeah, they gotta have a, a counter spell also. So they have curiosity and counter spell. God damn it. Alright, that's fine. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. So we get the we're gonna fight with fire the Djinn now or the Jin, because we um we can save this for later. It's just more flexible. Yeah, I think that's what we wanna do. Alright, that's fine. I would love to scry, but if you miss an alarm, we're just dead, so it can't do that. Commune. Alright, I mean, we gotta find a green source in five cards. I think we can do it. I think we'll be alright. Yeah, there we go. That's nice. Get those back. Kill this before they can't do anything. God, I miss auto tap so much. Okay. Upkeep scry. Charter course, sure. I want that. Now it's Sword Tooth or Banefire. Um they just drew more cards, so if they have curiosity next turn, it's pretty bad for us. I think I like just clearing the board. Got spell pierce? Wow. Wowzers. Alright, that's fun. How far can this little grizzly bear go? I don't hate making land drops, honestly. They have five cards. They probably have some sort of counter spell. Uh. Like that's bottom this. Just do better. Just draw a removal spell or something. Tilt. All right, we're gonna sword tooth here. They'll probably essence scatter it to pave the way for alpha next turn. Sure. All right, they have five cards in hand. They just for sure have more counter spells. They haven't played the creatures. They haven't played the curiosity. They must have at least one more counter spell, if not more. Uh, let's scry. I'm not going to cast alpha, probably. I mean, we can just no I'll bottom it. We can always stack a treasure if we have to. If we, we want to draw, want to cast the alpha. I like lightning strike here. That's perfect. We'll just strike this on their upkeep. Could have dive down also, whatever, it's fine. This is a really so slow clock, you know? We're not really too worried. That's great. 
They wasted a hard counter on a lightning strike. That's dope. We're very happy about that. Rootbound Crag. Okay. Now we're just going to start drawing cards at Treasure Cove, and we're, we're going to Bane Fire of his 2 2. They could have Dive Down, but I think we're going to crank it. We're going to make it uncounterable. Let's draw a card first. But. Field of Ruin, sure. This feels silly, but we need to get things off the board. There's the old uncounterable Bane Fire. Could have spell whatever the thingy is, but like that, they can't have that because they cast this on their turn. So, all right, board clear. We have two cards a turn for the next two turns. We have Alpha. They have six cards in counter spells. We're just gonna play around counter spells. Uh, two, four, six, eight, nine. This would be ten. We can cast this. They counter it. We cast Alpha. All right, let's cast this first and see what happens. Merfolk Trickster, sure. And the Counterspell? Cool. Well, now you got the Boom Boom. You hold on to this card forever. And now our superior creatures can take over. Tempest Jin. Alright, that's that's scary. That is very scary. Melvin. And the unblockable creature. Alright. Well, we got a lot of draws here. We draw a land. We draw a frenzy. We're gonna play the frenzy first and not play the card out of our hand, because if we have a land on top, I wanna clear it. So here we go. Top card's land. Then a fiery cannonade. Wowzers. That is dope. Um, and they don't know about it either. All right, we're casting it. And then we're going to attack with both. Yeah, Mono Blue is very, very curious obsession based. Without obsession, they're just not, not particularly good. All right, they're at 10. Exclusion Mage? Why is everyone playing Bounce Spells? It's actually unreal. I don't think we've played against an opponent who's not had a Bounce Spell in their deck. And Bounce Spells are like, like this card's good in their deck, sure, but like, obviously Bounce Spells are so good against Frenzy. Oh my god. Can we kill them with the, um, the Alpha? If we just crack it? Alright, let's draw. Mountain. Thunderherd. So sick. So sick. Alright. Um, there are 10. We gotta kill this thing. We have Crushing Canopy. We have the 4 damage spell. Alright, let's cast this thing. An Alpha. That's tough. And a land on top. All right, let's clear this. We got a hit here. Ugh, we're dead. Man, that's a tilt. All right, we lost to a stinky blue deck. We play that differently. I don't think so. I'm not sure. Tilt. Two and two. That should be a good matchup, I would think. Um, like, I, I guess, I'm sorry. The the old version of a deck with the more removal spells should be a good matchup for. This version, I mean, our creatures are so much better than theirs, but without the, well, without the earlier removal spells, they can get out under us. I don't know. Yeah, the blue deck is obviously very popular in Arena because it's, it's so cheap and easy to build. So, two and two. Ugh. And everyone keeps bouncing our cards. Everyone. Bounce spells for days. Ugh. 
in hindsight, ignore the bear and save the removal spell for the for the djinn. Yeah, I mean, we were at eight. You know, like, maybe... It's tough. It's tough. All right, let's go. Also, Lana Elves is so good against them. We're not playing Lana Elves. So, all right, let's go here. Let's get this 3-2. Let's, get, get uh, let's keep... Overgrown Tomb. Haven't seen that card yet. Sweet. We're not playing against Control. They can't have bounce spells in their deck. This is this is a dream. Dream come true. I think Arena's pretty sweet. I'm pretty impressed, honestly. Alright, so they're playing uh Golgari. We're, we're gonna want this Death Gorge Scavenger, probably. I kinda wanna land, but Scavenger seems so good. This this is like our scavenger matchup we've been waiting for, so. Abzan. Jumpstart Shock. That card's just too bad. Ooh, that was a good draw. Alright. Mismatched Dual Lands from our opponent. Alright, Abzan what? Abzan Explore. Two swamps in their hand, sure. Sword tooth. Uh huh. So we're seeing here how playing all these expensive dinosaurs does change things a little bit as far as like our frenzies. What's up, Brennan? How's it going, man? Karma Golf, new sub. What's up, my friend? What's your name? Where are you from? Questions are in chat. Welcome. A lot of subs today. You're all awesome. Thanks, everyone. Varaska. Brett Blackman? Is that like the Brett Blackman? I don't recall what your motor name was back in the day, but what's up? Probably gonna kill my kill my map here. I'd assume no. They are just doing the thing. Right. How about a land for Reach Star Alpha here? Sure. Probably have Chupacabra in their deck, but Alpha's still good there. So yeah. Regis our Alpha is pretty good. I mean... Alright, attack for Raska. Vivid, Vivid Color, I'll figure it out. I just haven't got a chance to do that yet. Alright, Golf is Luis from Toronto, playing since 2000. Card Bolt, deck Cheerios, puppy named Krenko. Thanks, Luis, appreciate that. And, uh... I'll be playing Arena. I play Arena and Magic Online, so it's both. All right, they're saying go. It's seven cards in hand. This is obviously super sketch. Um, looks like either... Oh, boy. This looks like a Settle or a Contempt. I'm going to fire in Alpha here, and if it gets Settled, it's actually great for us. So we'll, just we'll just have a bunch of lands and play for Frenzy. So, just bombs away here. And we're going to go all, all out of Raska, I think. What's up, Winner? So they, have, they have Contempt. Okay, so they Contempt the first one. And our second one won't have Haste, but the two three threes will. And they also have Trample, so that kills Varaska. This feels great. Yeah, Frenzy makes Settle not, not nearly as good, for sure. Just having a bunch of mana in play to, to Frenzy with is great. Main deck, Lyra Dawnbringer. Alright, I mean, we, have, we have answers. Um... We're going to upkeep Scry here. Look for an answer. Thunderherd Migration is not an answer. We're going to bomb that. 
Oh. God, we are so good. Life's just so easy sometimes. Rar. Rar. Dawn of Hope is a very good magic card. A very, very good card. How's football going? I'm skipping watching football at the stream for you folks. I hope you're happy. I'm going to peek in, though. A Chupacab. We are... Oh, my God. Pwn's team is going off. Matt Ryan needs to take it easy. That's scary. Chupacabra kills Alpha. Fine. Assassin's Trophy is in hand. That's annoying. All right, we're going to flip this map and scry upkeep, play sword tooth. We still have the three threes, still in good shape here. We have double frenzy. We're in good shape. Everything's good. Just the old Veraska and Delira deck, you know? Oh, we're at the bottom of this. This card stinks. Territorial poop bag. Commune with dinosaurs. Hmm. I think I like just attack. We have good attacks here. We can play commune and sword tooth and stuff. Let's just get to commune first, I guess. Lands or death gorge scavenger? I just want the lands, I think. I don't need more death gorge scavengers. We're pretty good on that. Alright, let's slam jam. Oh, we're, we're good on City's Blessing. Imagine they'll block the merfolk. No? Alright. It's pretty aggressive. Um, Surround sword tooth. We got a scavenger there too, maybe, but I just don't think we really need to. I don't think we're scared of dying this turn. Like. Yeah, I mean, Exile and Lyra is reasonable. They, they have find. That's fair. It's some mana base they got here. Just the casual turn two double green, turn three double black. Sorry, turn turn three double green, turn four double black, turn five double white. You know, just it's no big deal. You know, in BD. Right now, none of their creatures block our creatures effectively. So, yeah, I think I think Death Gorge is very very good in the current format. Um, a lot of stuff for it to eat. Assassin's Trophy targeting Treasure Cove. Sweet. Alright, it's time, folks. Lightning Strike? Every time just to kill our opponent, honestly. Um... We can go... Strike frenzy, a strike, strike scavenger frenzy. All right, sure. Is find an instant or a sorcery? Whatever, we're gonna find out. Cool. It's a frenzy. That's awkward. Okay, so we'll play. We're looking to peel some lands off the top here, so. Any order? Reach store alpha. Awkward, but whatever. Yeah, I mean, this is a. Uh, this is a pretty big blowout here, honestly. I don't see this game really, uh, leave Contempt again? Sure. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> contempt away, friend. Contempt away. Hi. Yeah, huh? Alright. It would take, like, another Lyra, and, like, I'm not even sure what it would take for a opponent to win the game at this point. Knight of Autumn. Sure. 
Now I can just cast Regisaur Alpha next turn. Suppose this deck is better if they actually kill your Frenzy. Um, because we just have more, like, just big doofy things to do. Other, the other version of a deck is more focused on actually frenzying. Alright, we team. Exile. Raska. Yes, please. They are really trying. I mean, the the wrath will kill our stuff. We just have a frenzy, though. It doesn't really matter. They have it. They have the wrath. They have it. Sure, it's fine. We just have frenzy sword tooth, so we have the the rebuild in our hand. Our hand is the uh, the whole point of the deck. So. Would Frenzy be playable without the self-destruct ability? Uh, it would be worse. Find. Returning Chupacabra and Knight of... Oh, I mean, they are really, really grinding here. They are trying their best. You know, they're not giving up. They're not giving up. You gotta give them some props for not giving up. So now they have Chupacabra. They're just dead anyway. So we... Attack... Again, this is definitely a worse frenzy deck than our, our initial initial version of this deck, for sure. It's a frenzy. Land. Land. Sure. Now they have Chupacabra in their hand. We still have frenzies. Yeah, we, we have some respect for our opponent here. Our opponent is really, really trying. Uh, I thought they were going to have an Assassin's Trophy there to kill my thing. That would have been insane. The Awakener. Okay. It's not, not go running lands here, please. Oh, Lightning Strike. Kill ya. A Chupacca. Yes, version 2 was a tuned version of the, the version we played on YouTube earlier this week. Um, we went 2-3, but I think it was non-representative. We lost to two Adanto Vanguard decks. That card's hard for us to beat. And the games are still very, very close. And we lost to a blue-red spells deck based around Arcbound Phoenix, or whatever it's called. Arclight Phoenix. And that seemed pretty hard for us to build. We, we couldn't really interact with them, and that was still really close. So, it was a very, very strong 2-3, in my opinion. Tay Andy, resub eight months, thank you. Alright, so we're gonna want some more exile stuff. We're gonna want some Death Gorge scavengers. Uh I'm gonna cut here. We wanna We want some grind for sure. They're a very grindy deck. I think I want this. Maybe just cut down on the lightning strikes a little bit. Maybe Bane Fire is not necessary because we have Fight with Fire instead. And then maybe we cut a land on the draw again. I don't mind cutting a land on the draw. Excuse me. Is Fiery Cannonade better? I don't think so. Cannonade kills our scavengers too. Sometimes. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, guys. Dinosaur. Everybody do the dinosaur. Everybody do the dinosaur. Derp, 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 derp. Yeah, this is a keep. Um, I again, I think if you're gonna build this deck, I would build the other version. I would not build this version. It is football Sunday. When do I usually stream? During the week, uh, during the day. Usually like at 8 30, 9 a.m. start time. And I stream usually about till about three o'clock on like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then not on weekends that I'm traveling. The schedule is not set in stone, but it's around that. Um, again, if you missed the other version, it is this version right here. 
is a, a video of a slightly older version on YouTube. This this video from earlier today will go up uh, a little bit later. I built this version right here if I were going to try and build this deck. Alright, they got a Branch Walker. It's Wadevskis. Find finality. Armor, new sub. What's up, Armor? Thanks for sub. Appreciate that. Alright, this is fine. We get to uh, Sword Tooth, extra land drop. They bin this. Oh, they bin one and they kept one, maybe? Oh, it's only, I'm sorry, it's only only explore one, so. Alright, play that, play land. This card's pretty good. Find finality. Yep. Okay, so we're playing our stuff. We want to. They didn't shoot a cobra. They didn't play a creature. Probably have contempt here. Uh, we could also have trophy for this thing. We're pretty all in on frenzy, so we only have one. Uh, I also want to. I'm gonna just gonna lava coil this. I want to be able to strike on their turn, untap into coil frenzy. So I know exiling that's not great, but it's still fine. I can just wait here. Contemskis, sure, it's fine. Not ideal, but fine. Gonna have slam Lyra here. It would be annoying if they had Lyra. I'm not gonna lie. You get a double spell to kill it. Jeez. Look at these people and their mana bases, you know? Is mana and mana and standard that is really that good? Is it really that good? Alright. Well, this is what we're doing. We're, we're we're emptying the clip and then we're playing Frenzy next turn. So could be worse. We're also exiling the Lear, which is nice, so they can't get it back. Don't duress me. Wild Growth Walker. Sure. Alright. Here we go. Commune with Dinosaurs. Sure. Reach Store Alpha, Rootbound Crag, Thrashing Brontodon. I kind of want to just cast Reach Store Alpha, honestly. Um, they can't Contempt it. Gets him for three. Having an Alpha in play... When we play Frenzy, is very, very good. I'm just gonna cast the Alpha. They could have like a Chupacabra or something, but I don't know. Again, this is a little bit of the the tension between the Dinosaurs and the, the Frenzy in this deck. Um, our Frenzies are not as good, for sure. Cup of Joe Rassic. That's not bad. That's not bad. It, it's Dunkin' Dinos now. We're committed. We're committed to the Dunkin' Dinos. Yeah, four cards in hand. What is this? Sure. I'm totally cool with that. They waste a, a wrath to kill their creature and my... So this is a straight two for one. And... Wait. Oh, they screwed up. I, I misread this card. They could have saved their creature and they just didn't for some reason. Okay, that's weird. I mean, that would really have been screwed up. Um, okay. We're going to leave a strike in our hand. I don't think dealing three of them is relevant, and I want to be able to cast things if I draw them. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what they just did. Oh, my God. That's we're good. We're so good. Oh, yeah. Let's go. All right, that's fun. So, yeah, opponent punts. That's nice. Would have had a 3-5. Actually, would have, been, would have been kind of troublesome, honestly. Might have Autumn to kill my Frenzy. All right. This is the, the first deck we've played against that can kill Frenzy over and over and over and over again. Between, between Assassin's Trophy and Knight of Autumn, it's been a little annoying, I'm not going to lie. But that's okay.
life finds a way. You spend so long thinking about if you could do a thing, you never stop thinking if you should. You stood on the shoulders of, of giants, and then you took their work and something, and you didn't even earn this. I don't, I don't know. Jeff Goldblum, if you're watching, I'm sorry, my friend. Why is Frenzy still on the deck post board? Because it's, it's the entire point of our deck. That's why. And even if, they, even if they kill it, it's still very good. We'll still get value off of it. So. The Jets are winning? Wow. I didn't, I didn't even see my DraftKings lineup yet. That's the important one. All right. Night of Autumn. Uh, this is fine. It doesn't matter what happens here. Again, I do a, uh, a DraftKings lineup with my, with my buddy Jay. Whoever does better wins the week. Whoever wins more weeks over the year has to, the loser has to take the winner out to a really, really nice dinner. So let's check our DraftKings and see how that's going. I don't see a reason to cast this strike yet. We're probably going to, but we can just wait and see what we draw. Treasure map? Sure. All right, so let's do this now. So let's strike. And attack. All right, how are we doing? Not even playing yet. Ooh, Tyler Boyd and Sanu and Ebra. We're doing pretty well. We are... We're crushing. We, we, we haven't had our, our Rams go yet. Oh, we're crushing. We're going to crush Jay. Here we go. This is it. We're down 3-1. We have to crush. We have no choice this week. All right, we got to move a spell here so our guy can attack through. Remove the Contempt. The Jets are beating the Colts. Actually, in a funny tie together to all of this, um, I actually went to a Jets-Colts game in Indiana with my friend Jay, who I'm doing the bet with, and Nicole was there, and they were playing the Jets. I'll, I'll, I'll bring the picture up in one second. Let's just attack here and see what they do. That is actually very funny. It all ties together, you know? Let's find that picture. I'll find that picture for y'all. That's great. That's perfect. Nicole was there too. End step scry. J E. Can you with dinosaurs? We gotta keep it on top, right? I can't find it. Two cards in hand. Cast Commune. Up oh, there it is. Found it. There's me, my buddy Jay, and Nicole, and Jay's wife Maggie. And uh, me and Jay are doing this DraftKings bet. So I, I, I beat him last year, and Jay and Maggie took out me and Nicole for a really nice dinner. And then this year I'm losing 3-1. So DraftKings is very important to me right now. All right, we have Scavenger, Scavenger, and Lance. So let's get a Scavenger. Any order. Let's uh, let's mush. Eat a spell. What's up, Eddie? The Colt Stadium is super nice. Uh, a really, really nice stadium. That was a few years ago. All right, uh, we're gonna play. We, we could not play this and play on the wrath, but like this is just fine. They wrath, they don't really care. We have treasure map gonna flip soon, so let's exile uh, their creature. Yes, please, and ship. Merfolk branch walker. Ah, just the card they need to get out of a situation. They draw swamp. Do I want another Death Gorge Scavenger? We could do better than that. I'm going to bottom that. How long ago is that? God, we're so old. I think old stinks. All right, bottom that. Did my, greed did my greediness pay off? 
Kind of. All right. Well, exile their stuff. Sloth with the resub. What's up, my friend? Welcome back. The only thing better than a new sub is a returning sub. Thank you so much, my friend. I appreciate it. Everyone show some love and chat for our returning subscriber. Double chumps. Sword dude is a 5-5, so it survives the uh, finality wrath or whatever. We have drawn cards next turn. This is just, this is just over. The old 3-2. The old 3-2. Dunkin' Dinos version 3.0. Alright, so let's see here. Um, alright, this is this this is the version of the deck I was playing previously. This is version one and version two, basically. This is the non-dinosaur version of a deck. I think I like this version better still, but dinosaur cards aren't bad. Uh Allosaurus was really bad. You gotta cut that one. I think we don't need this many dinosaurs. I think we have I think like 10 or 11 is probably enough for Thunderherd. Probably cut like double Allosaurus and go from there and be add like the third and fourth map. map. Ma map's just so good. Like map's just unreal good. Um, you can maybe try and fit Llanowars in this deck too. That's pretty tough. Um, playing Llanowars and Communes a lot. But deck's pretty cool. I think it's still worse than the other version, but it's definitely fun. Registrar Alpha is sweet. Um, Alpha's obviously very good with our frenzies. Um, Death Gorge Scavenger, I think, is just a good card in the format in general. I think his card is just quite good at the moment. Um, good against the graveyard decks, against the spell decks. A lot of graveyard stuff happening, but not a lot of ways to interact with it. And Death Gorge Scavenger is a main deck way to do that. That's also good against aggro decks for gaining life. So, this is sweet. Um... As far as like a hybrid, I don't think you'd want Regisaur without all this other stuff too. I think that just having the, the burn spells and stuff like that, like removal is so much worse against this version, you know? Um, the only creature to really kill is Sword Tooth, so it's not great. Um, you need Lightning Strike, you need, or you, you need early removal. You could maybe play Lava Coil, but the problem is if you flip it with Frenzy and then have a target in play, it sucks, so, but yeah. Overall, the deck is pretty sweet. Um, Carnage Tyrant, also very good against the Jeskai deck. Very, very good there, too. So, um, overall, yeah. Deck's pretty cool. So, if you're watching on YouTube, that's going to do it. Um, YouTube, I'll see you fine folks next time. Right, YouTube? Make sure you follow the channel. I'll see you guys next time.